It's not every day you go to Pinewood, though, is it? So it's like a one-in-a-lifetime experience. I like to see how they made the films and what really, how they really did make it because I thought it would be a lot more glamorous than what it was. We went on to James Bond, see, the new set, and um, I, because I'm watching the films, I'm not used to the background, so I was wondering like, what all the scaffolding was. And when we went round, it, it showed how it's changed. It was like a big contrast. Were you a little bit disappointed by the... I was. I wanted a brew with you. did hench me. <laughs> I thought we'd get a brew with James Bond in that, but it's not happening. These guys have just come back from a trip to Pinewood Studios in London where they got to grips with the reality of filmmaking behind the scenes. They won the trip after their film, The Lost Brothers, which they acted in and improvised, came out top in the Clapperboard Youth Project. They beat five other Salford schools and staff here feels that the win builds on skills they're already developing in the performance arts classes. This was a perfect way of them being able to get into things like camera angles and sound all sorts of things that they wouldn't have had any direct experience of without it. So it was just a perfect thing to, to fit into the exam syllabus, as well as being such a, a good experience for them to do something new. There's two brothers, and one of them hawks calls fire service, but at the same time, the other one's trapped in a burning house, and one dies and one goes to a detention centre. I want to go into a career in performing arts, so I think that this experience has really helped me. Pupils here at Harrapfold Specialist Arts College got to work with writers from East Enders in finalising the script of their film. It aims to highlight the dangers of antisocial behaviour. Is there a message behind the film? Yeah, not to hoax call the fire service because it can really do a lot of damage. To check out the winning film, log on to the web address below or head into the centre of Manchester. The Lost Brothers will be shown on the city's big screen until the 15th of February. Georgia Calvin-Smith, Channel M News.